And more on that, the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, presents certificates of return to the 23 elected members of the Bielsa House of Assembly. And this took place at the Professor Mamoudi Akobo Media Center in Yanagoa, the state capital. Various recommendations was given to lawmakers to channel their interest on their constituents and to ensure quality presentation. Do not forget your constituents and your constituencies. They made it possible for you to be here today. We don't get back and forget about them. That would be too bad. Remember, the game is not over. And the lawmakers promised to bring their wealth of knowledge to bear and create laws and projects that will benefit the people. The assembly, the assembly will address a lot of issues. The function of the assembly is clearly here. Yeah. We have two major functions. Approving resources for the executive to manage and overseeing how this fund has been expended. And creation of legislation, how laws will be created to add value to the society. Those are our functions. And I think number of members who have experience, who have been lawmakers in this House of Assembly over 12 10 years, we come up with the, uh, the knowledge they've acquired within this period to support the system. First, I want to hail the women of Bielsa, because the women of Bielsa, not just my constituents, stood solidly behind me, and I'd like to give them, to dedicate this certificate of return today to them. They supported me with their voice, with their substance, and I think it's novel, you know, I think we women have decided to stand by each other and I want to tell them to have the strength to pursue their vision and whatever their dreams are and that it is possible. Over eight years, primary education is non-existent in my, in my constituency in 27 out of 32 communities. That we are going to reinvigorate, we are going to restrain and we will see to it that it works because we believe strongly in education. Secondly, in 31 communities we don't have we don't have any primary health care center. We are working assiduously to see that we bring this back and um, we we'll get primary health centers functioning in our communities. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.